When you approach a motionless person, attempt to find out whether the victim is responsive. Tap and shout. Grandpa, are you okay? If the person responds, they are said to be responsive. If the person does not respond, they are said to be unresponsive. Hey, go call 911. Have a bystander call the local emergency telephone number, usually 911, immediately. This will ensure that professional medical care is not delayed. With the victim on a firm, flat surface, open the airway. Place one hand on the forehead and the fingers of the other hand just under the chin. Tilt the head back and lift the chin. In an unresponsive victim, the tongue may be blocking the airway. The act of opening the airway may be all that is needed to help the victim to start breathing. Next, check to see if the victim is breathing. Look for the chest to rise and fall. Listen and feel for signs of normal breathing for up to 10 seconds. If the victim is not breathing, you will need to breathe for him. This is known as rescue breathing. Check circulation for up to 10 seconds. Look for any signs of normal breathing, coughing, movement, or improved level of responsiveness. If the victim is not breathing, but has other signs of circulation, begin rescue breathing. If there are no signs of circulation, you will need to begin CPR. This skill is covered in detail in a later section of this video. If the victim is breathing, roll him onto his side in the recovery position. If the victim suddenly vomits, this position will help keep the airway clear.